Hello again. Now we are coming from the site where we have taken the raw data of in situ density testing. We are going to record the mass of sand before we have get 99.2. Then after putting the sand in the pit, we have got 51, 56.5. Then mass of sand in corn and plate equal to, as you see those numbers, that means that you have to take mass of sand. This two means mass of, of sand before. Then this number three is mass of sand after. Means that you take mass of sand before minus mass of sand after. Then mass of sand in corn is measured before starting the test. This is 1290. Then we're going to calculate mass of sand in a pit. As you see here is four, four minutes that is the mass of sand in corn and plate minus five, which is mass of sand in corn. Then the density of sand, this must calculate it before going to use that sand on site. Now we're going to calculate volume of pit. As you see here, the number six, which is mass of sand in pit, divided by number seven, which is density of sand. Then mass of humid soil. Remember that after digging the hole, we have been taking all soil from that pit. I have measured that seven, zero, zero. Then we are going to calculate humid density, which is equal to number 10, which is mass of humid soil, divided by number eight, which is volume of pit. Then, remember we have taken sample and we cook. Then, mass of humid soil, we have taken 15, 65. Then after cooking, we have got 14, 35. Then, and the mass of can was 10.5. The mass of water, uh, you see those numbers, means this is 13, means that is mass of humid soil minus mass of dry soil with can. Then mass of dry soil, that means 14 minus 15. That is mean mass of dry soil with can minus mass of can. Then the moisture content equal to 16, number 16, divided by number 17 times 100. Number 17, 16, sorry, is mass of water divided by Mass of dry soil times 100. Mass of water divided by mass of dry soil times 100. Then we're going to calculate dry density. This dry density equal to number 11 divided by 1 plus 18 of 100. This number 11 means that is humid density. This one is from formula note, this one here. You see this one is the location. The reason why this one is from, from, from formula. Then 18 is moisture content and divided by 100 equal to 
Number seven is humid density divided by one plus moisture content divided by 100. Remember to put the bracket. Put the bracket here. Must be two bracket. This much a content must divided by this hundred first. Then you put another bracket. Sorry. Yes. As you see, uh, the dry density that we need to calculate or recite equal to 2.327. That means that our soil has this dry density. After getting this dry density, you can calculate the percentage of compacity index by taking this dry density in C2 divided by the reference proctor have been done in the laboratory. There you can say this road is very compacted or not. Thank you very much.